Heartbreaking is how the governor and state police described the tragedy. Two troopers dead, along with the man they were trying to help to safety after being struck by a vehicle. Police are calling this DUI related and say speed was a factor. For all three, it's a reminder of how precious and fragile life really is. Governor Tom Wolf joined state police at the Troop K barracks to mourn the death of two state troopers, 33-year-old Martin Mack III and 29-year-old Brandon Siska, and the pedestrian they were helping. All three were killed on Interstate 95 around 1245 in the morning. Troopers Mack and Siska made the ultimate sacrifice this morning while assisting a citizen in need. The troopers were called to I-95 near the stadiums to assist a man walking in the southbound lane. Police say a vehicle traveling at a high rate of speed struck all three. The impact was so great that it threw the troopers over into northbound lanes of Interstate 95. Investigators say the female driver remained at the scene, but they are calling the crash DUI related. Tow trucks removed the damaged vehicles. A procession of police cruisers followed the fallen troopers to the medical examiner's office in Philadelphia. They both had bright careers ahead of them, and it saddens me to know how their lives were senselessly cut short. Trooper Mack was a trooper here at the barracks since 2014. Trooper Siska just since last year. The Troopers Association say they will be honored forever by all who serve. Live in Philadelphia, Barbara Barr, WGAL News 8.